Join me as we embark on a historical journey with Kawasaki, a brand that has become a byword for innovation and speed in the motorcycle world. From its humble beginnings to becoming a leader in motorcycle engineering, Kawasaki's story is one of ambition, ingenuity, and the relentless pursuit of excellence. Kawasaki's journey in the world of motorcycles is an intriguing tale of strategic shifts and engineering brilliance. Founded in 1878 by Shozo Kawasaki, Kawasaki Heavy Industries initially focused on shipbuilding. The acquisition of Magura Motorcycles in 1960, then a notable manufacturer known for its robust designs, marked Kawasaki's serious entry into the motorcycle industry. The first motorcycle to roll out with the Kawasaki badge was the B8 in 1961, designed by engineer Gyuichi Inamura. Featuring a 125cc, four-stroke engine, the B8 was a testament to Kawasaki's commitment to quality and innovation, laying the groundwork for its future in motorcycle manufacturing. The following decades saw Kawasaki emerging as a formidable name in the motorcycle industry. The 1960s in particular were pivotal, with the launch of models that would cement Kawasaki's reputation. The W1, launched in 1966 and heavily influenced by Maguro's expertise, was Kawasaki's bold answer to the Western-dominated large displacement market. It was a technical marvel of its time, reflecting the engineering acumen of its chief designer, Tomio Fuji. <laughs> Racing also became a significant focus, with the company making its mark through the A1 Samurai and the A7 Avenger. These models, known for their impressive power-to-weight ratios, were the brainchild of engineers like Ichiro Shiraiwa, who played a crucial role in developing Kawasaki's racing pedigree. These bikes not only excelled in performance, but also began shaping Kawasaki's image as a maker of fast, reliable, and innovative motorcycles. As Kawasaki expanded its global footprint in the 1970s and 80s, it also ushered in an era of groundbreaking innovations. A notable figure during this period was engineer and designer Ben Inamura. This model, also known as the Kawasaki 900 Super 4, featured a 900C DOHC engine and it set new standards in motorcycle performance. The Z1 was a game changer, propelling Kawasaki to the forefront of the superbike market. The 1980s were marked by the introduction of the GPZ900R, the first bike in the now legendary Ninja series. Pioneered by a team led by engineer Gyoichi Ben Inamura, the Ninja was the world's first liquid-cooled 16-valve sport bike. Entering the 1990s, Kawasaki continued to innovate and redefine motorcycle technology and design. The decade was marked by the introduction of groundbreaking models and significant advancements in motorcycle engineering. A notable figure in this era was Shunji Tanaka, whose design contributions were pivotal in shaping the future of Kawasaki's motorcycle lineup. The ZX series, particularly the ZX11 introduced in 1990, broke new ground with its aerodynamic design, becoming the world's fastest production motorcycle at its launch. This model set a precedent for what Kawasaki aimed to achieve in terms of speed and design excellence. In the 2000s, Kawasaki continued its innovation streak with models like the Ninja ZX-6R and ZX-14R, constantly pushing the boundaries of power, speed and technology. These bikes exemplified Kawasaki's dedication to leading the superbike segment with cutting-edge technology and unparalleled performance. A significant milestone in Kawasaki's recent history is the launch of the Ninja H2R in 2015. The H2R is not just a motorcycle, it's a marvel of engineering, representing the pinnacle of Kawasaki's technological capabilities. Powered by a supercharged 9098cc inline-4 engine, the H2R is a track-only motorcycle that has set new standards in terms of power and speed, producing an astonishing 310 horsepower. This motorcycle showcases Kawasaki's advanced aerodynamic design with its carbon fiber bodywork and distinctive trellis frame. 
Kawasaki's focus has also shifted towards sustainability and environmental responsibility. The exploration of electric and hybrid models is a testament to Kawasaki's commitment to addressing the environmental challenges of the 21st century, ensuring the brand's relevance and leadership in a rapidly evolving industry.